Thank you. 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 Transportation means cars, trains, airplanes, and buses, and so on. Which one then do you think can first? I mean, trains, buses, or airplanes? You might surprise with the answer when I tell you. I think the transportation and broken is very important. You can give it to me. Yes, uh, transportation plays a significant role in the local economy. So I'm gonna give you some ideas about the transport in the UK. Looking forward to the 18th century, the best method uh, of transport for a person traveling alone was on horseback. Heavy industrial items and raw materials were usually transported by uh, pack horses, coastal shipping, or along the coral rivers. Road transport was low and reliable, dangerous vehicles together with road, uh, bad roads means that uh, transportation had made a, a major crisis in the 18th century. Turning to the water transport, there were two types of uh, water transport in Britain available before the 18th century, uh, coastal shipping or and uh, Nebulo rivers. However, although those both types uh, uh, water transport were useful. They still have they still have their problems. That, for example, rivers could flood uh, during winter and dry up during summer months. Uh, so something new was needed. Mm. It became obvious that canals would be the next step forward in the in the transport revolution. The new network of canals brought many benefits to industry and agriculture, but as industry bombed it, it was soon apparent that the canal network was too slow. The original railways in Brinton were simple systems operated in mining towns. The expansion of the railway's network was held up by different problems. No one knew how to build efficient and fast uh, railway network properly. Financing early railways was also difficult because banks were not sure if they would be successful. Once railways were established at Brinton's newest and farthest uh, communication and transport uh, system, they started to have a number of effects on Brinton. These effects can be uh, put into three main categories, social, uh, political, and economic. For the shape of social, the railways broke down stereotypes and mystic cultures because people from different regions uh, were able to mix more. Railways also uh, encourage people to travel further, and people can uh, were able to take short holidays and day trips to the beach. <coughs> uh, with respect of political, political movements spread around the country, um, and members of organizations were able to travel around the country to drum up support, and members of parliaments. Uh, were able to move quickly between their constituencies and the houses in, of parliament in London. <coughs> Turning to the economic, um, railways became a major employer because people were needed to build, run and maintain uh, railway services. The transport of heavy materials became much cheaper. One of the biggest Britain's uh, export was local motives and uh, train parts. People were willing to invest in uh, railway stocks and this boosted Britain's economy. So this is my part regarding the history of transport and its impact on Britain. Thank you.
Then I'm also planning to visit London. Uh, I don't uh, whether I don't know whether my uh, uh, budget will support me or not. Uh, Okay, I will give you some, some information, maybe can help you, but I have a question. Have you got a travel license? Travel license? Yeah. No, unfortunately, I haven't. Okay, firstly, I will tell you how to apply travel license. Okay. <coughs> According to the, the age of 17, look at this. The age of 17, you are candidate to travel in Britain. According, according to Britain law, the people who have 17 years can then how can then drive, drive, drive. So it's first that you must go to the post office and get a free application form and fill out the forms. And especially you fill out the uh, date of your birth and the uh, state of your birth and you need it uh, physical. And uh, when you finish the finish the, the film, you must uh, you need to pay something first for these forms. And uh, send, send to send to D A L V and January seven seven works and you will still uh, later you will begin begin to your drive lessons. Okay, according according to the Britain law the, there where there are more than three years of travel experience they can tell somebody how to drive a car. And you know the uh, 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 every almost the family so many so many families uh, uh, have own their own car in in UK so Usually, they usually um, uh, use their own car to learn to learn drugs and complete with his family and uh, it's uh, uh, save money and uh, companies. And uh, when you uh, when you start uh, okay when you start uh, drug lessons, you need to pay uh, twelve pounds uh, an hour for this. And when you finish the drug lessons, you need to take uh, examination. The examination contact is same to China. But in, uh, in uh, addition to you need to pay thirty five pounds for this examination. So next, sorry. Buy car, about buy car. Whatever you buy, second car, hand car, or new car, uh, already have plant and uh, license plant. Uh, and when you get a case and we go re registration, you need the first call to the insurance company and uh, and to amend the the vehicle's information and uh, and uh, and to uh, take uh, take effect immediately and you can drive your car but this time your first this is it is your first time to buy a new car it is difficult to ring immediately and uh, driving car without uh, insurance is legal in UK so is the uh, risk is too high so this is uh, important the most important point so you, you you must remember <coughs> that you can't drive a car if you if if you have not uh, insurance, uh, and uh, you can you can if you ask me what can I do, I think uh, you can ask your friend help you, but your friend must have drive drive license and uh, insurance insur insurance insurance, and uh, ask uh, your friend help you to take your take your car <coughs> to go to home to your home, and uh, next and uh, between video in the videos may be cheaper, but uh, you need um, more experience. Test. The price in uh, according uh, price includes uh, seventeen point five percent of VAT and uh, one hundred ten years pounds for a uh, real tax. This is uh, according to uh, Britain law. This must be be paid. Vehicle inspection. And every village, every village towns and uh, cities, uh, so many places you can check. Uh, Check inspection, a uh, check check sorry check vehicles. And new car need an uh, inspection with three years, but uh, three years later you need you need a uh, um, you need an uh, inspection uh, once once a year. Insurance. Uh, uh, okay, every every each each vehicle need to have insurance. This is uh, uh, it is uh, according uh, you, you, need, you must have insurance if you're driving car without uh, insurance is illegal. So you, you must remember that, that point. And uh, buy a vehicle 
vehicle insurance is 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 a pet company. You can you can get a free tariff insurance company for free tariff number, and uh, go to any one of uh, insurance financial institution to buy vehicle insurance. Rose parking. Uh, uh, a uh, few places need pay and a uh, few of uh, uh, tunnels and uh, bridges maybe need pay, need pay. And any public roads and parking place can be free. So this is, don't worry if you drive a car outside and uh, anywhere you can park here. Don't pay. And uh, important place comes up, uh, for example, and, uh, the four police, local police placement car and uh, stop, stop here. Yeah. The revenue statements of vehicles and drivers. Across the uh, vehicle registration card, the police suggested that uh, we don't we need uh, to put it in your car and uh, put it a uh, safety place. And uh, if you if some someone and uh, carry carry your car, they can sell your car. So it's very important. You must remember. Uh, road tax license, you, uh, you, need, you just need to uh, stick, uh, stick to the window shirt, it's okay. Insurance documents, uh, and, uh, and you, you don't take care of it, you just need the uh, insurance type number. In driver's license and the vehicle inspection certificate, and, and you, you can carry it or not, it's as, as okay, whatever if you want. Uh, Okay, that's my, that's my part about a private a car in the UK. Okay, thank you. Thank you. So, but there are you